So obviously it was probably a, a round journey for you to end up at Ole Miss, but just finally getting here after the detour to just how do you feel about being in your home station? Man, I'm happy to be back. Um, like I said, like I always say, it's, it's nothing like home. Um, being in the southern environment is just, it's nothing, can't match it. Um, you know, being closer to home, closer to my family is just, they're right behind me, so I'm here. I know it's a long story, but can you kind of talk us through from the transfer portal to committing to Ole Miss, what the process was that brought you down to Oxford? Oh, it was a really easy process. Um, Kirby and, and the coaching staff did a great job of recruiting me the first go around, so just to, Going through the transfer portal, I knew uh, right away where I wanted to go, so it made it real easy just coming back home and, and being that guy that could help us be a, a tournament uh, team. What do you see your role being with this team? Um, just one of the guys who can do it all. Um, very versatile that uh, can help lead a team to being more than just an average team, like I said, being a tournament team. A lot has been made of the newcomers like you and, mm -hmm. uh, and everybody else, but like when you see Jarkel and, and Matt and they bring so much like I tell everybody um, every day like everybody's their own leader we don't have one leader on the team and that's something I'm glad about this team um, everybody just brings each other up each and every day you know one person might be slacking so somebody else has to step up and, and be that guy to you know hold everybody accountable and we got guys like that around us you know guys like Jarkel I haven't seen somebody match my effort and energy trying to you know, his work ethic is, is, is crazy. So just met, seeing, seeing a brother work like that is it, motivational. So, and just other guys like Austin and Matt that have been here already, just seeing those guys grow every day, it's nothing like it. How'd Matt get so big, man? My man, I, do you tell me I need to get in the weight room like him? <laughs> nah, he puts in the work, though. Um, you know, puts his head down and just works, and he's going to be a great guy for this team. Definitely. It's a big jump. Uh, I just tell him just keep working every day. Uh, you know, tomorrow might not be your day, or today might not, might not be your day, but tomorrow will. You know, you just got to keep working. And and today is every day is it's each own day. You can't worry about yesterday or worry about tomorrow. You got to worry about today. More questions in here. Neil, we'll go ahead to you on Zoom. I was real close. I, that's why how it made it so easy for me to come here the second go around. I, I love Ole Miss um, with my heart. You know, I was a rebel at heart. That's why I'm here now. Oh, like with everything you, with every opportunity, you'll you'll get something out of every year. Or each team you go with, you'll pick up something new. Um, I learned a lot from Coach K and the coaching staff and the individuals I was around. So just going there, I learned so much. And I'm just glad to be here so I can learn a lot more. When you look at your role at Ole Miss, do you view it as more of an of a inside game? Is it an outside game? Or are, you, are you trying to be a slasher? What, what is sort of, how do you fit into the offense? Definitely, I think I'm, I'm very versatile. So I can do it all and play inside out. You know, just contribute to the offense and defense multiple ways. Any more questions on Zoom or in here? Just expanding your game, the reason why you left there, just being able to open yourself up more and kind of have more of a dominant role, if that makes sense? Oh, most definitely. Um, just being able to express and, and show my play, my play style, just being able to come to a place where um, I can express that and, and I know I'm in the right place for that.